Hello, I am um, freezing a little bit. So um, anyways, I had bought a bunch of clothes because I have a shopping disorder and um, I wanted to open it. So I thought I might as well make a video. Um, but yeah, at the point of making this video, um, I'm 33 now, which is kind of unbelievable to me. And um, yeah, while my skin's still clear-ish, um, I thought I'd make a video, so. Well, anyways, since it is cold, I did buy some um, warm clothes a while back, and I just haven't opened it because the weather started warming back up. But now it's like, there was like this freak hail storm, and the temperature dropped back to like normal winter time temps. Um, I thought it was a good time to like open it instead of like opening it and saving it for next winter. So yeah, um, I guess I'll get to it now. So these two warm items are from Hollister and um, this is like the new Hollister, like a rebranded Hollister. Um, back in my day, Hollister was basically the cheaper version of Abercrombie and Abercrombie didn't look like what it does now which looks more like a Zara-ish place rather than like a dark cave with black and white photos photos of like teenagers with really hot bodies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, anywho, I, this is from like the clearance section. I just wanted a new cardigan because all my other cardigans are kind of small. So yeah. So in here is my new large cardigan. I got it for like, I don't remember how much. It was for like $27, it's oversized, but a large, because I like how like oversized clothes are like proper for your size, but it's oversized, so it works. I, I don't know. So it looks like this. It's very wide. And yeah, I like wearing like oversized now because it just, looks more balanced since I like wearing tighter pants um, and this is originally like 60 bucks no 50 bucks 60 if I was in Canada so yeah it's this is like more fall than winter and then this one I actually thought I wasn't gonna get it in the end because it was like back ordered or something so I guess they were like delayed and then I guess we're looking to see if any other Hollisters had it and shipped it to me or something. But yeah, so this one's an extra large and then because it was cheaper than the large. And then I don't remember if there was any larges still going, but I didn't want it that bad to want a large. So this is like um, what I'm wearing right now. This is really old, but it's like from Uniqlo. It just, it was, it's just literally like a fleece least jacket or something. So, it looks like this. It really looks like a teddy bear in a bag. So let's just hope um, extra large means runs small. And then hopefully this is machine washable because um, I don't remember reading too far into this. So it's a faux fur jacket. I actually thought it was gonna be like the inside was just gonna be this, but it's actually not. It looks like. Actually, never mind. Lies I tell. I was looking at the lining of the pockets and I was like confused. So yeah, this was like MSRP seventy dollars. So I guess I'll. Uh, um, try these on for you because I want I might want to wear them later on but yeah um, it was pretty cold this evening and then I was just wearing this so I was like I'm like freezing right now So obviously you wouldn't wear like the way I'm wearing right now, but I like how like the sleeves are a little longer and then it's still like perfect 
lengthwise, but it's very wide. And then it has no pockets, but I don't mind that. But yeah, my older cardigans are like this high, and it just looked very strange to me. So now I have like this droopier look, which I like. As far as warmness goes, it's not super thick, but I don't mind that. Yeah. This full fur jacket, extra large. Let's see how large it is. Ooh, it's so soft. So it looks like this. That's stupid. <laughs> yeah, like how like the length of it's not too. Um, awkward on me since it is extra large, but yeah, oh my gosh, and it's like there's lots of extra space in here so I can like wear more layers too. Not bad, not bad. So this is like um, probably Christmas kind of clothes, at least in California. And then moving on, um, I guess I'll open this ASOS package. I might open my My Protein short shorts just because um, it's been there for a while. Maybe I'll make it into a separate video. So in this ASOS package, I don't really remember what it was, um, but I have been buying a lot of uh, new tanks. I also did just like yesterday night, order another ASOS package because I needed to buy something to put my wallet in since the weather is warming up that I can't put my wallet in my judge leggings, tights. Um, so. I needed something to carry it so I don't lose it when I'm grocery shopping. So here are like some clothes. What top? I'll do the warmish top first. This is an oversized sweatshirt because I'm on this like oversized high thing, so. And it's um, this lilac purple sweatshirt, this pullover, not really super special. Um, I guess I can put it on. So it looks like this. I kept my jeans on just literally because I was considering making a video. And yeah, I like how like the length is perfect. So it's not like too here. So I feel like can crop up a little bit and then my arms and it has like that boxy shape so I like it I think I wish this was a little more white than cream but I thought this looks cool this one I think is a tank I don't really remember but yeah I had like a bunch of um, shirts saved in the little like favorite section when you like put stuff in your cart and it just moves over after that one hour and I saw some price drops recently too so I was like woo! Pro tip would be if if it's not out of stock just keep checking on it for promo like codes to get a deeper discount. So which is pretty much any like US holiday. So yeah this is a Night Addict tank. Um, I think this is one of those like ESO sub brands. And it's not really special or anything. I got this because it was cheap. Large. It literally just says limited in the front and then night addict in the back. And it's like the most random like placing um, for the word. Next up is this. Yeah. 
Lens tank. Um, it's like XL slash L, and the back has like this like Egyptian beetle thing. Yeah, I thought it looked cool, so that's why I got it. I don't know how large it's gonna look on me, but we'll find out. And then this is a training shirt, I think, because um, a while back I had that Puma one. I wore that to the gym this morning, actually. Um, and then, I don't know, I just saw myself wearing a t-shirt to the gym. I was like, hmm, I like how this looks, so I wanted to buy more. So, I got this Jack Jones shirt. Oh, I know why I got this shirt. Um, it's literally because of this. <laughs> like, the, sh the sleeves has like, it's like, it has this, I don't know, it's this band and it has like that trend with the words on it. Yeah, I, I kind of like missed out on that part, so. Um, now I got it. So yeah, that's that. Um, I should try it on before I forget. Okay, so this is that cool shirt. Um, it's a little tighter than I thought it would fit, but really cool looking. Um, it's actually it kind of looks okay and untucked. I think it's because it's a little more fitted, but I probably would work out like more something like this. Um, I'm not too into like wearing too muscle fitty shirts because like my stomach isn't the flattest so when it goes like that it's not like the most attractive but this is blue and the shadows are like hiding those details. I'm cool with this. This band that was pretty tight but not like um tourniquet tight. <laughs> So yeah, um, dope. Okay, so this is the purple whatever tank. It's not super special. I just wanted it because it was cheap and it's not black or white. So um, color-wise, I like it on my skin. Um, Fit-wise, that's awful. I don't think it makes me look super awesome or anything. And it looks kind of cool. Probably be wearing it like this because I'm old. Yeah. This one's large, mama. So yeah, this one's definitely gonna be like a tuck it in sort of thing. It literally goes past my butt. But uh, I thought the print was cool, so I got it. <laughs> so like this is like the equivalent of those girls who wear like really big clothes and they wear a belt over. Yeah. <laughs> Now it looks a little more cooler. Um, but yeah, I can like, this is basically a cape. But I, I dig it. So yeah, um, that's it for that part. So yeah, um, in this box is my, uh, Short shorts endeavors um, from uh, wanting like five inch shorts, um, more five inch shorts. So I got this from My Protein, but um, since I was so wanting to get it that I could have gotten an extra five percent off when I didn't because I couldn't wait any longer. Um, these are their, like yoga shorts. They're not very really cheap, so. Um, that's why I was like so on that promo code. Um, 
and they looked like they were of quality but i don't know i pretty much just got it because i saw some other hot guy on instagram word and i was like hmm <laughs> so yeah this definitely won't be the last of my short shorts buying but it's not Gymshark ones for sure, um, which those I am okay with, but they're not like the greatest. So if they had like short shorts with like that kind of sleeve from that shirt that I wore um, earlier, that'd be cool. I've seen some Koreans on Instagram wear something like that. It's not really shorts, it was like tights, but I like the concept. Wow, do they really have to do it like this? Okay. So for me, um, I don't buy from my protein, especially since I don't take like whey protein. Um, I don't know if I've gone over this before, but probably I probably have. But um, I do pay. I do take powder supplements, but um, it's not like for protein. So um, for breakfast, I just have a shake. So I get a powder shake which is supposed to be like the equivalent of a meal and then that's how I start off my day every day um, but I don't take it from my protein um, the, only about, the only thing I know about my protein is that they have a brown sugar milk tea one flavor but not for western countries for some reason uh, so yeah um, so if you hate protein shakes maybe try like a like a milk tea flavor. Um, as for me, I just my shake is um, vanilla flavor because I think it like mixes well with anything. Um, with a cup of blueberries, um, two to three bananas depending on how ripe they are. Um, some flax seeds whole and um, brewer's yeast because it has lots of vitamin B. Um, and then my Vitamix can grind the seeds, so I just throw in whole seeds. So yeah, you don't really want to buy powder uh, flax seeds because it oxidizes, so you'll lose your nutritional value that way. So first off, the waistband is a little nicer than the Gymshark ones. I don't really like their logo though; it looks kind of simple. So yeah, can you see the the waistband? And then there's also a tie in there, so it's not only just a waistband, which is cool. There's also pockets, but uh, no zipper. And it is not lined, so wear your underwears. And then I got the same kind, but in two other colors. So there's this one, and then I got this one in this green color. And it has like the slit on the side. I don't know how much it helps with um, movement, but I think these aren't even like marketed towards training. It's more for like yoga and stretching or something. Um, but I just wanted like the five inch uh, length and then I was hoping the fit would be a little nicer while also being really flexible. So yeah, and then this is like gray or black. Okay, I mean, live as hell. This is black. <laughs> so yeah, it has that waistband, and then it has the tie in here, and then it has this like logo that looks like a hologram, but it's not a hologram. And then like, I think it, like if you ever paid full price, it would be like $40, which I didn't pay for that much. I think it was like 20 when I got them for, um, when I got them on sale. And these are called the composure shorts, before I forget. Yeah. Okay, so I guess I'll try them on with all this plastic bags. So I guess I'll start with black on black first. Um, ooh, this waistband is really strong. <laughs> That's a good thing though, because like, if you um, are like me and you wear the Gymshark ones, the waistband is really uh, loose. So when I actually tie my pants up to here, where like my 
waist is, it like eventually slowly goes down because the string is very like weak. So I mean this band is so strong. I don't even really need to tie it. And I, I already like seeing how high it goes up. So I get, I approve. And then it's like, this really helps because I can actually go down without like worrying too much. And then I like, my butt looks nice. Um, I have shape, so I don't look like a block. Very cool. I like, I like a lot. And then to like secure, I can totally do that. Yeah, I approve. And then for some variation, here's the one in green. So yeah, I'm quite surprised at the waistband and how like strong it is. So here's some contrast since the other one kind of hides everything. Yeah, these shirts are pretty cool. <laughs> pretty good. Yeah, I can totally squat these without worrying about like it going like so forth. And then definitely check with what length you'd like. And you kind of get what you pay for. This is like if you get on sale, it's basically a little bit more than what Gymshark charges you. So yeah, shop smartly. Okay. And then I think on Rakuten, you can also get cash back, so don't forget about that. So yeah, and if you buy supplements from them already, this is one of those like filler items, I guess. Yeah, I like how this looks. And like, I can totally still stretch and feel cute. Pull this up a little bit. I like, I like a lot. So yeah, um, I guess I can link it. I won't get anything out of it in the bottom, <laughs> but I like, really cool. So um, I thought it was my short video for this. Um, yeah, see you next time, I guess. Um, like and subscribe if you want. Uh, until next time, bye.